what was your reaction when you heard the criticism of it was too woke? Mm, I have heard it. A lot of my friends are, you know, big fans of the show and they spend more time on social media than I do, but they, they really, they want me to know what's going on. Um, I think if you're doing something different, especially with an iconic story, like these women Mm -hmm. inhabited and sex in the city, there's going to be a lot of criticism and the criticism doesn't necessarily mean that you made the wrong choices or that your intentions were off. It just means that, it's kind of getting people talking. And I, a long time, because, you know, I've been doing this for 15 years, baby, and I I figured out a long time ago that much of the audience reaction doesn't actually have to do with the story or the storytellers, but has more to do with them and what they're bringing to the story. Now, having said Mm -hmm. that, I think some of the criticism was fair about the show um, not being, you know, diverse enough and inclusive enough in its earliest iterations, but... I do think that they're trying to do something different with this next chapter. And the truth of the matter is that chapter is, is actually the Sex and the City chapter is closed um, yeah. and hoping to open up a, a, and tell a new story on. And just like that, I, I'd love to like have a real opportunity to really just open it back up for a season two and really dig deeper into it. Um, uh, I'm hoping we have a chance to do that with HBO. Um but HBO Max, but, you know, um, these, these, these times are so, I don't know what you think, uh, Debbie, but these times it's really uh, fascinating how important it is for people to stay on one side of the argument, the other people to be all the way on the other side of the yeah. argument. I'm, mm-hmm. I'm looking for ways we can, we can find common ground, which is why, you know, Um, talking to you is really important and and your audience is important. I mean, we we have to find places now, especially after the last several years um, that we've had in our society and our culture, we need to find more places where we can say, Hey, you know, let me give give them some grace. Let me, let me, you know, give them the benefit of the doubt. 